What up, my name is Brad, welcome back to Dragon Ball Legends. So today we are talking about the newest Zenkai that was announced. Um, it is the old school Frieza, and he definitely deserves it. I don't have a problem with that. I actually don't really have a problem with any of it. I don't mind Zenkais, but, you know, it's always just kind of like, ugh. That's our content for the week of the Zenkai. Okay. Sick. <laughs> if you enjoy the content on the channel, make sure you do sub. Uh, leave a like on the video. So we're going to talk about this a little bit, break it down a tiny bit. Uh, go into future Zenkai thought process as well. And it all lines up all too well. Final Form Frieza's Zenkai Awakening is coming. Super boosts his firepower by unlocking all his uniques. Draw one random card when you have three or less. Oh my gosh. When facing a Saiyan. And restore your key by 30. He's a perfect attacker to pit against Saiyans. So, genuinely, this Frieza probably, there's a good chance he'll save LOE. Um, Red Frieza is obviously fantastic. The one from Dragon Ball Super Broly, not the golden one. Not the random one that came out of nowhere uh, from Resurrection of F. Not that guy. But the Red Frieza from DBS, the Blue Extreme Frieza is actually very much runnable. Or LF Frieza, either one there. Both first form Frieza's. And then this guy. That sounds like a pretty deadly t uh, team. So he has massive increased damage to strike. Uh, well, to Saiyans with his strike as of right now. And I mean, he got a buff previously, so stats aren't terrible. But he was never like crazy good. I mean, he's always like pretty decent. But he was never like, oh my gosh, kind of good, right? I'm down. It's cool. I won't be summoning. I'll pr I don't know. So it depends. Because there's no other banner. And I'm always like, well, I should at least get him Z3. Right? Because in a Z3, I can at least test him out. See if I like it. See how I feel about it. But then I'm always like, I don't really care that much. You know, am I going to run Lineage of Evil? That's my thought process. And I don't know that I am. It's a good team. It's totally viable. Has a lot of free-to-play options. You know, this Frieza being one of them because how old he is. Like I said, the extreme one is solid. Uh, the red one, if you happen to get him on the DBS, Broly, and Gogeta banner, totally possible to run that, but I don't know. I won't be summoning. Let me know down below. Are you going to be summoning? Tweet at me over on Twitter, RadicalYT. Uh, let me know. Are you interested in going in for it? Are you eh? Whatever. Doesn't matter to me. Let's talk about the other units. This is the best screenshot I got, boys. Like, this is the best one I got. <laughs> I can't really. If I go to fix it, it makes it large. So we're just going to have to rock with it like that. Um, you can see where we have red metal cooler, yellow Frieza, and LF Frieza. So if you're not super duper inundated with Twitter and everything like that, like if you're not on Twitter very often, which I get, Twitter's a little toxic from time to time. Uh, the old one, well, like a month ago, we had gotten a screenshot exactly like this. Uh, during, I think it was, I think Rush said Jump Festa. Yeah, it was during that Jump Festa where where they were fighting and their match caved out. Um, and it was LF Piccolo, Blue Trunks, a Super Saiyan 2 future one, and then uh, God Vegeta on a team, which made no sense at all. And then LF Piccolo got a Zenkai, and then Vegeta, well, Vegeta, then Piccolo, and then Trunks got one. I'm assuming we're going to see a very similar thing to this. Which, I'm okay with them leaking it like this. It doesn't really matter in the grand scheme of things, right? It's, it's fine. Um, I I don't really want three back-to-back -back Zenkais for LOE. See, that's the difference, because the previous one was not a coherent team. I mean, it was Super Saiyan 2 Trunks, Vegeta, fine. Vegeta family, you can make the argument there. And then Piccolo, and it's like, all right. So it was kind of like out there. With this, I mean, we knew, we knew, we know LF Piccolo is going to get a Zenkai. I don't know why it's going to happen eventually. I don't know why they went out of order for um, Piccolo, but I'm hoping, I'm hoping Frieza, they rectify that. And we can at least get another LF and then wait like two months and then get this Frieza. Hopefully the screenshot is just showing, hey, they're in the lineup for sure. Like we need units like, I don't want Sun Family to rise up again. But we don't need to be skipping ahead to Piccolo and Frieza because we're scared of Sun Family getting a Zenkai. Gohan is still running the meta. It doesn't really matter. Like, it's not going to change anything if Gohan all of a sudden has a better 
Goku to work with. He already has Super Saiyan 3 to work with. Or a better Goten. He already has the yellow Goten or Namaku. It really changes nothing if Goten or Super Saiyan 3 get a Zenkai at this point. So we gotta stop skipping this crazy order of putting these units on the back burner who have been around for borderline two years at this point. And being like, you know what? We're just gonna do Piccolo and Frieza. And it's like, okay. So hopefully this screenshot doesn't lead up direct. I don't want week after week after week to be Lineage of Evils. And I don't want that. I won't enjoy that. I won't have a good time with that. I'm already probably really gonna get max C3 on this Frieza because I don't run Lineage Evil that much anymore. It's been a long time since I really liked using that team, and I only liked it when it was, like, really good. Like, when Full Power first came out, Golden Frieza, it was solid. Even when Blue Cooler, before he got his Unkai, he was able to hold up a little bit. It was really good. And then around the time Bojack and Gohan came out, that was when it fell off the face of the earth. Um, let's put it this way. If those three get his Unkai... We're good. Yeah, it's it's gonna be like a top five team, cause Cooler's already stupid. Well, he's not stupid, right? When he first dropped, he was okay. He was really nasty with Zamasu and like Piccolo, a couple other ones, because you could run this team that was like undefeatable. And even now, you want to chuck him with uh, Fat Boo and your Fat Boo Z7, you can make it work. He ain't good, but he can work on a Regen team. If he gets his Enkai, gets any kind of like solid stat bus. He has a team heal. He's pretty defensive. He makes you drop your cards. There's a lot of things that that cooler does. LF Frieza obviously does not need one. He'll get one. He obviously does not need one. And then Frieza. Be a pretty solid team at that point. I don't know. I'm not really too worried about it. Um, it doesn't really bug me. Nowadays, Zenkai's, I love the idea of Zenkai's. I'll touch on it a tiny bit and then we'll probably wrap this video up. I love the idea of Zenkai's. I've said it since day one. They just do it wrong. Legends just does it in a way that's just not exciting. It's just like, we have no content for weeks. And I know people are like, well, Brad, you know, we got like, uh, this try, just try to surpass me event, which by, it's not even fun. Like, it's not that it's like super hard, you can beat it, but it's not even fun. Because there's like a reward for it that's like, oh, it feels kind of essential, right? Like, and they're just like, well, it's a mystery gift. So go ahead and spend five hours trying to get this thing within 90 counts. And it's like, great. Now, I have a pretty pay-to-play account. <laughs> I can't, so I don't define that as, like, fun and rapid content. But Legends has been that way forever, right? I can't I can't sit here and say they transitioned. That's how Legends has been. So it makes sense. Um, I don't know. I just I don't like... I don't like how Zenkais are done in Legends. I never have. And that, that's the biggest issue I have with it. It's not that Zenkais are a thing. I think they're cool. He's going to do yellow lineage evil. They might even shift his main ability. We're talking about that in the podcast. That's super dope. Like, I, it makes you... Now you can run full power. You can run the extreme second form freeze if you just want to spice it up a little bit. Try to have a little bit of fun with some different stuff. That's why Zenkaiser are cool for bench building and all that kind of stuff. But it's not content. And that's a big... It's not content. Like, switching between a Zenkai banner and a normal banner every other week. That's, that's not content. Like, I, I don't know. It is what it is. All right, well, I'm going to get out of here. I've rambled long enough. Let me know what you guys are excited for him. Do you care? Do you give a crap? Do you just whatever? I don't even play Lineage Weevil. I only use God Key. You probably want to skip then, and I get that. But I'm out. I'll catch you guys around. Thank you so much. Deuces.